Hello everyone, Richard Evans here from WP Central and today we're going to be taking a look at how to set up your Facebook chat and Windows Live IM in Windows Phone. So when you first got your phone or if you haven't done this already uh, go into your emails and accounts and to set up Messenger uh, from Microsoft you simply add your Windows Live account which you can do through the phone setup when you first turn it on and that will bring down your contacts, calendar, email if set up with Hotmail and of course access to the Microsoft Windows Messenger. So that's all set up and dandy and that's ready to go in the messaging hub which we'll look at in a minute. Uh, but how do you set up your Facebook chat as well? So we have our Facebook account added here which will bring down the uh, contacts to your people hub and add photos, uh, integrate Facebook with your phone and enable Metal notifications and whatnot. But that's not enough. So we've got our contacts from Facebook and everything set up. We also need access via Windows Live to use the chat. So to do that, uh, as is said in the tutorial on the website, which you can read up uh, in full detail, um, you pop to live.com and enable access through Live ID. Um, it's really simple, really straightforward and only takes two seconds. You can even do it on your phone which we can actually have a look at. So if you just pop to live.com Right, so now we're signing in. So now if we scroll down and select PC site to get out of this mobile site view where we won't be able to add these services we require. Right, so now as you can see on the main page you have the messenger social where it brings down the news of all your contacts and it shows you what services are connected to your live ID. So as you see we have Facebook there which is what we need. And here we are, we have Facebook. And you can add it, you'll need your um, login information for your Facebook account for Facebook Connect to, to actually connect to your Live ID. And once it is connected, you'll need to, oh, that's Twitter. You'll need to make sure all the enough permissions are granted for the account so uh, your phone will be able to access and be able to chat with your Facebook friends. That's the permission we're going to need. Uh, that's the bare minimum we'll need uh, to activate the chat on the phone. So once that's selected and saved on your live ID and everything set up on the phone side with your Facebook account and live ID itself, you'll now be able to go into your messaging hub, scroll along to online and change your status to either available busy away or offline, uh, appear offline or offline. So first of all we have a bit, uh, available which will activate both the uh, messenger and Facebook chat. Next we have busy which will of course set busy status on your messenger, it won't affect Facebook. Away, same as busy, appear offline which will obviously set your status to invisible on messenger and it will also sign out of Facebook chat because that doesn't have the same functionality and offline will keep you offline off both accounts. So if we select available and this will now log in to both Messenger and Facebook chat and it will bring down who's available. So that's all the contacts ready to chat to. And in the threads, where you have SMS and everything else, you'll be able to... I don't think I'll be able to... it's a read-only message. Uh, you'll be able to switch down here, there'll be another icon for switch. And you'll be able to choose which service you'd like to use on that contact. But if you cannot connect for some reason to Facebook chat itself, you have to go into your settings in the messaging hub and ensure that Facebook chat is activated. And that is it. You'll now be able to chat to all your friends on Facebook and Messenger on your phone while on the go. So you can read up the full article on wpcentral.com for more information, images and the walkthrough itself. And have fun chatting to everyone. Thanks very much for watching. Take care.